Hi everyone and welcome to my place. I'm absolutely devastated that we have this terrible virus that is bringing us all to our knees. I'm also really shocked to discover that the hand sanitizers have just gone out the door and I don't know whether people are stockpiling and whether they're just thinking, well, I'll be fine, but you know, you don't need a whole lot of hand sanitizer. The other thing I need to tell you is it's got alcohol in it and it's got pretty severe kind of alcohol like isopropyl alcohol and there are other alcohols that they use. Um, that ingested, and because the skin's the largest organ on the body, it can be ingested. Now, the World Health Organization and our doctors here in New Zealand are all saying that good old-fashioned soap and water and a good 30 seconds of rubbing front and back is the way forward. If you are out and about and you're caught in an emergency, you can't get any hand sanitizers. I've got a really quick and easy recipe with just two ingredients, which works a treat. The only tip I need to share with you is, the alcohol that I'm going to use is, is isopropyl alcohol or ethanol you could use as well if you can get it, but even that's getting hard to find. It leads, needs to be at least 70% alcohol base to make a difference. And if you're thinking you're gonna use vodka, well, I don't know about that, I'd just drink that because unless you're using a grain alcohol that is of high quality, I think you're kind of wasting your time. Okay, so I've got a little 100 mil container here. Everything on my surface has been completely um, hygienically wiped. And with the, high, um, the isopropyl alcohol, I'm going to put into here 80% of 70% alcohol so I'm just going to put that get that right in and up to 80% so there's my 80% there of just the wow. isopropyl alcohol don't forget 70% and then into that I'm now going to add and I'm not even going to use a funnel I'm just going to use my hand I need to put 20% of aloe vera into there so I'm just going to just pump that into my bottle until I'm almost at the top. Once you get to the top, stop for a moment, give it a good shake. And don't forget that, as I said, this is just for emergencies if you can't get anything else. And I've got all my family out and about with just little wee bottles of this. I'm going to take that right to the top of 20%. So that's 80% of 70% isopropyl alcohol and 20% of aloe vera into your 100 mil. There we have it ready to go. I would still verge on using the soap and water as opposed to something like that because, as I said, the skin's the biggest organ on the body and it does and will ingest some of that alcohol. I hope this helps you out in an emergency at your place. Keep safe and I'll see you again another day. Mm -hmm.